actually not uphill. I thought it, it looks uphill, but it's actually not. It's downhill, technically, according to this thing. Bang, what an eagle to finish. All right, we're just going to be outside the top 50, though. Damn it. Russell Henley wins, is it? Oh, Russell Henley so beats Scotty Scheffler by a shot. Take home the title, and we do just finish outside the top 50, unfortunately. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another EA Sports PGA Tour career mode video. Today, we are going to be taking on the Wells Fargo Championship at Quail Hollow. Quail Hollow is... Quail Hollow? Quail Hollow is a tough course, and I'm really looking forward to this battle here. So, Wyndham Clark won this tournament last week, actually. Uh, he beat Xander Shoffley on the final day uh, to claim a victory there. And we're going to see if we can do something similar. We're one over through nine, as you can see on that leaderboard but the leader is only uh, three under so we're only four shots off the lead if we can get a good run going here you never know what might happen so we're playing alongside Patrick Cantley the slow poke once again and three to five mile an hour winds average course conditions so it shouldn't be too bad let's uh let's jump on in and let's do this thing I'm ready baby Sports. I'm ready Quail and Hollow let's go Tour let's have you the Thursday whole location for the playing off the back cup back tees of course Quail Hollow, Quail Hollow is beautiful North Carolina we present live and it's fun opening round coverage of the Davis Riley Sparkle leads at three under a couple of four unders too we have in we begin the inward I go over that bunker yes par five ten I'm going over that bunker because I'm hitting round the power drive here at Quail Hollow we last saw this course during oh the did I push it or what United States beating the feisty international team 17 and a half to oh. 12 and a half for their ninth straight win in that competition but Frank, let's talk about the golf course. Talk about the Ryder Cup. Is going to have to do to handle our President's Cup, was it? This week. Well, Rich, I'm going to have a shot back at you, Rich. Why are you going to bring up the uh, the, the internationals <laughs> losing another President's Cup? Anyway, <laughs> there you go, the President's I, Cup. I loved, how, yeah. I loved how they played, Frank. But, they really fought hard. Well, that's, that's, that's a very condescending remark. But back to the golf course, because <laughs> that's the question. You know. <laughs> that's a very I, I, condescending I really remark. Done, or, you know, quite a lot of evolved. Oh, I from, love the commentary uh, you know, in this game, man. Really it's great. Really what it was in the 60s. Um, golf course has sort of got this bigger yeah, got landscape, layout. bigger presentation. And really, it stretches every part of your game. You have to be long enough, that's for sure. You have to be bold enough. And especially, you have to finish your round because the green mile gets anybody's attention. That's sitting down under there. Oh, wow. What did I hit? What did I hit? Did I hit the tree above me? I really don't know what I hit. Because I don't think I even got as far as the big tree that was overhanging. So I must have hit some other tree. Patrick Cantlay is going to be laying up. There's no chance he can go for this in two. And I don't think there's any chance we can really go for it in three now at this point. But we're going to try. From the rough, might be difficult with a three wood. Yeah, again, I'm just going to have to punch this. There's no way I... Wow, I cannot believe that. Guys, you guys are going to have to get out of the way here. Because I will hit you guys. Please. I think I'm just going to go over their heads. This is going to be close, though. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Morons, honestly. They need to do something about clearing the crowd in your direct line. They don't give a damn. We're going to have a good, good situation all over again. You know? First hole, by the way, if you missed it, Gary Clark absolutely pegged the sport. <laughs> a, a spectator with his uh, with his drive, which sucks. I saw people, like, going way overboard on it, though. Like, they shouldn't have audiences. They shouldn't, like, relax. That shit happens in professional tournaments, too, you know? People hit bad shots. People That's hit shanks. Professionals shot. hit shanks. Yeah, it happens. Garrett's a great golfer. So like, every chance. time I've watched him play, he's, he's top quality, you know? So I think it's really silly for people to go overboard and, and try and get them, like, cancelled over this. It's ridiculous. But that's the way the internet is these days. They'll try and uh, tear everyone down because they don't got nothing better to do. Great shot. We have that for par, unfortunately. Not the ideal start we were looking for here at Quail Hollow. We're not in the best form coming off the French Championship, our worst finish yet. We're going to need to be, do a little better here to make the cut at Quail Hollow and, uh, and hopefully get ourselves into contention heading into the, uh, heading into the PGA. God damn it, it's going to be a bogey on one. I didn't give it enough power. Needed a little more juice. That's going to be a bogey on one, son. What can you do, eh? Not much you can. Patrick Cantley. Slips by for birdie, so he's gonna fire it. We're gonna bogey it, and uh, we'll move on to the next one with a bogey. All right, okay, could be worse, could be better. All right, so what are we playing? Four, a par four, par four, par three. How many holes are we playing? Five holes, four after this. Okay, 
Cool, cool, cool. So I don't think we get to that next power five, but the way I played this power five, probably better yeah, off. <laughs> All right, Patrick, what do we got, baby? Yeah, we're playing part four, part four, part three, part four. Okay. Let's get it. I believe the start of the back nine in Quail Hollow is quite difficult as well. We moved down to 25th position, which still ain't that bad, honestly. Uh, part four, 462 yards. Okay. It is rich. The two The drive just caught us there. I don't think my drive was that bad, but I guess it was. It went way out there to the right. Because I was aiming pretty much fully to the left as well, which is crazy. <laughs> Um, it's a lovely tee shot the way in which it Good shot Patty. amongst the trees though on either side. Patty ice. In a deceptively quick green from back to front. Nice shot, lad. Nice shot. Well, you can't walk out and drop right. it any better than that. That is a fine. You can't walk right out there. and drop it any better than that. I probably could. Drop it like a time. I'm gonna go right at that bunker. Just wanna make sure that I'm leaving enough room. Yeah. Play a little bit of a draw too to be safe. A little slow, but should be fine. No, it's not gonna be fine, is it? Oh, it is. It's well over that bunker. I thought for some reason it was going in that bunker. See, that's Absolute beauty. how you can walk out there and place it better, okay? With a drive like that. Let's get back that stupid Second little bogey we had on the last hole, all right? That breeze can be tricky at his back. You don't want to overclub. Can it, I? That breeze can be tricky at his back. You hear this, loser? All right. Patrick Cantlay. Ooh. -ee. Love to see it, buddy. Five mile now wind with me. It's slightly uphill. I think that's going to be enough, though. A little bit over swing, maybe, and this should be perfect. Just like that. Too much over swing. Jesus. Tick. All right. Good shot. Leaving ourselves a decent birdie chance here. A decent birdie chance indeed. Patrick Cantley for birdie from 43 foot. What the hell's happening with my slippers here, man? No. Oh. Patty well, Ice. It's not a good line. You ain't making yeah. that, Patty. Come on. Oh my really god, good. he is! Oh, Patrick Cantley. I'm messing about down. trying to put my that slippers on here, and Patrick Cantley's draining bloody 43 footers. I'm an old man now. I can't get my slippers on. A little bit above, and I feel like I might break back the other way, but I think I'm going to go comfy with this. Just outside, right? No, it did break. That's what I was thinking in my head, and that's why oh, I should have. I should have went back the other way, but it's going to be a par here on two. Well, not on two, on 11, rather. Second hole that we're playing. Disappointment, that. So then, rushed in for Nearly missed that. Moved on to 28th. I assume it's because a lot of people are still teeing off, you know. That's why we're still so high up the leaderboard. All right, 12th is tough, though. Downhill par four. It's a nice one. Not getting the fairway off the tee. Again, it's a green light situation. Beautiful tune, huh? All right. I wonder what the cut line is going to be. I wonder what the cut line is going to be. Are we going to be battling to make the cut two two days in a row? Now nah, we're still early. We're still early days, you know. We haven't had a good start, well, but we're still early days. A couple of birdies will get us right back into into contention here. The ball, but, uh, still not too bad tree there I was just to aim a little bit out to the left and fade it in there Beauty. perfect that should fade down the left side and give us a good angle although that's overdoing a little is it no it's fine get away with it we're both on either side on the first cut well, nice little I think I'm gonna be a little bit further down than Patrick Cantley but neither of us in any trouble at all Let's see if Patrick Cantley can put it close off the rip it looks pretty long and left but not bad Decent shot from Cantley. I feel like that's clearly too much, so I'm going to bring it back just a little bit. I think this is going to be good. Uphill, into the wind. Nothing crazy, though. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No way. Have I made this? Have I made this? This is my first... Uh, this is my first heartbeat moment in career. Come on, give me the spin. Give me the spin. Come on. Come on. No. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> I thought for sure it was going to be in, man. Tremendous. Standing ovation from the crowd, but I can't help but be a little disappointed. If I had, this like, a, a, if I was playing on pro and had the spin available, then I probably would have been able to, to, to spin that into the hole, but I wouldn't have known which way it was going to going to spin anyway, regardless. But good shot by Patrick. Good putt, but just uh, just misses on the low side. We're going to tap in for birdie, though. I said we needed to make a birdie and, and make a little bit of a bounce back, and we've done just that. Tap in birdie there. My first heartbeat moment in career. I've had quite a few in challenges and stuff like that, but that's my first one in career. I thought we had an eagle. 
I thought we had an eagle lined up. All right. Important birdie there. We get back inside the top 20, as it sounds. Riley, six under, though. Pulling away with it here. Okay, tough stretch of holes. Oh, yeah, this hole. I'm going at it. Going right at it. On this green is going to be very, very fast. Um, also, the right side of this green, if you look carefully. Yeah, pushed out there, though. Shot of the right side, has a I don't know why, but in my head there, I for some reason thought I was going to get back to back RP moments. <laughs> uh, stupid of me. All right, 47 foot for birdie there. That's not very good. How are you doing, pal? That looks really good. Oh, that's going to be right out, is it? Why can't I see the pin? Oh, it's way left. Pin's way left of where we're actually aiming. It. I swear I couldn't see the pin properly. All right, me and Patrick both about 50 foot right of this thing. A little bit less for Patrick. Okay, so this is three degrees above. I feel like it does break right to left the whole way. Do 55 on on the distance. All right, this is gonna be a crazy putt. That's way low, way low. Way low. It was actually pretty good on distance. Just left it way low. I thought I was aiming a hefty amount right already, but I needed to go much further than that as well. It's, it's going to be a par here on 13. That's not a bad it's par, honestly. It's a tough hole. Well, I guess my putt there isn't a gimme, but it's up the hill. It should be fairly fairly straightforward. Patrick Cantney gives it a better go than me, but yeah, still finishes below the hole. Hard to give it an off break there, it feels like. Patrick Cantley is going to settle for a par, and it looks like we will as well. As I said, I'm not going to get ahead of myself. I'm just going to aim inside his marker there. Give it a rattle. Nicely done. All right, good par. We have one more hole left to play today. It would be lovely if we could birdie it and finish this round under par with the Sims help. If we could finish the round under par, I'd be very, very happy with that. Because I think the I, I think the cut line will be over par. Quail Hollow's tough. I think it'll be 1-2 over. We'll see. Usually the cut line in this game is around 1 under level par. But I think for Quail Hollow, tough course like this, I think it'll be a little bit more. We shall see. Oh, this hole. I love this hole, man. It's so risky, but you just got to risk you for the bisky on this hole. All right, where's the pin? Pin is up the back, 350. So power drive it is, and I'm going after it. I'm going after it. I feel like I can get it there. A little bit of a draw. I draw. Land it at the front of the green. Let's let's go. Oh, please. Keep drawing. Keep drawing. Please be good. No laying up with that swing. Oh, my God. What a shot. Nothing. Oh my god, it's too much power, though. Alright, not too bad, though. Should be able to get it up and down from there. It's not going to be the easiest chip in the world, but great shot. We're nine yards away for Eagle. Decent chance there to, to finish with a birdie, get back to level power on this all. Patrick Cantley going for it, too, is he? No, he's laying up to the right. Okay. Decent little layoff from Patrick Cantley, but uh, I feel like here it's an awkward pitch regardless, right? So I feel like my chip is nearly easier than Patrick Cantley's pitch here, so might as well so just go for it. Lot left to go here as he'll set up his second with his par four. Oh no! If you can pitch it like that, it's not much hassle to you. Great pitch by Patrick Cantley, and we'll see anything within that for us is pretty good. I feel like should have a go. Uh, I need to get over this upslope. Now, though. That's what I need to be careful goal. of. How about in? How about in for an eagle, baby? Come on! Oh my God, that absolutely caught the caught an edge there, caught the edge rather of the cup. I thought for sure that was going about ten to twelve foot by, and I think it would have if it didn't catch the pin there. Wow, that's awesome. He finishes one under. What are we gonna finish? Is the question. One over? You shitting me? I got us back under par with my section. Come on, that's cruel. The sim hasn't really fucked me over in this game yet, but that's the first time it's really done me dirty there. Well, I guess I only went one over for the remainder of the round, actually. I thought, yeah, I thought I was under par. I guess one over for the tournament, not for the round, right? I was one under, one over. Well, it's the first round, so obviously, <laughs> what am I talking about? But when I started my holes, right, I was two over, and then I, I bird, no, sorry, I was one over. I bogeyed, got to two over, birdie eagle, got back to one under, yeah. Oh, I doubled the last, okay, double the last hole, that's tough. Okay, that's tough to take. All right, I was wondering, I, I thought I only saw a bogey there on the last, that's why I was confused with the scoring. All right, double bogey on the last, gets us to one over. And we're going to have to battle to make the cut line. We're inside the cut line as it stands. We're 53rd. 
But um, we're going to need a decent round here and some help from the sim, which we did not get in that round, that's for sure. All right, so as it stands, projected cut line's one over. Current score, two over. I'm outside the cut line as it stands, playing the sixth hole. Oh, this is going to be tense, boys. This is going to be tense. Outside the cut line. We're going to need something special here, or else we could be missing our first cut. All right, we got loads of holes left, though. If we play, if we play these holes in... Things starting to slowly take oh, not this shape here hole, on this though. Friday. For some, it is a race. How many are they giving me here? Others, give me five. Give me six. Four? Oh no! I'm Davis gonna have to play these 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 four holes in two under minimum. Under par. Can't rely on the sim. Play at the par three. Two thirty-four to the front. This is gonna be long. I'm gonna hit the five iron. The, the problem is the fairway at the front of this green is so soft that if it lands short of the green, it just dies. That's not good. Look at that backswing. Ah, it actually would have been good if I didn't push it as well. Would have been good on distance, I think. That's a disappointing shot. All right, I'm just struggling at the moment. I really am. I don't have my best off. I'm struggling game-wise, gameplay-wise. Um, not ideal coming into a major championship, guys. Not ideal at all. Especially because I was in such hot form before these last two tournaments. I was really killing it. We won the RBC Heritage, and I guess we're just having a little bit of winner's post-winner drunkness, I guess. Neki Matsuyama didn't do much better there. We'll see if we can put this close. Great shot. Sit, 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 sit. Great shot. Okay, par here is good, honestly. This hole is difficult. Par here is, uh, is real nice. So we've given ourselves a good chance for par. A really good chance for par. By the way, if you want 20% off Rogue Energy, guys, use code Apex Sound. Mixed Rocket Pop with uh, Rainbow Candy today. Always a good... Pleasurable mix. Good shot, Hideki. Well done. Fair play to you, pal. It's quite a bit below. Ooh, just holds on. Just holds on. Come on. That's awesome. Let's go. Hideki Matsuyama. Good little par. A little par for you, buddy. We want any chance of making this cut? We need a couple birdies. Perfect start. 546 yard par five here. Come on. Avoid those. You have a good chance to get home in two. Come on, this is it now. Eagle time. We had one eagle in the last round. We still finished over par. This time we're going to make an eagle and we're going to finish under par. All right. Two ten left. Iron in my hand. Let's put it close. The deck is inside the cut line as it stands right now, and I don't see it moving from one over. If it, right now 43rd is, is level par. The deck Beautiful drive, but it's just a little left. Oh. He actually had a perfect straight drive, but. Just left. He's got to go for it, right? He He's got to go for it out of his bunker. That's in the water. No doubt. No doubt in my mind. Oh, that is right, and that... Oh, it's actually not far away. I thought it was going to be more in the water. So now after right. the drop, this is risky. Again. But I don't... I, I do think this gets there. What about a little bit of a low ball fly? 213, 9 mile an hour wind. The wind into me doesn't affect it as much, and it's downhill. I feel like this is actually going to be good. Oh, it's risky. I'm actually going to put a bit... Nah, it's left. Thank God I pulled it at least instead of pushed it. But not what you want, really. Okay. About 60 foot, I'd say. 62 That's foot for birdie. Really for eagle, rather. But two putts. Take a birdie, move on to the next one. Yet. We'll take that. Uh, I'm a tough time. Deki Matsuyama. If he makes the putt, or at least gets down in two, then Looking I'm good. Great shot, him on the salt. Great shot, Hideki. Great shot. Fair play. A little bit of spin even on that one. Okay. If I can two get this anywhere like in five foot, within five foot. Jesus Christ, this is going to be difficult, isn't it? Long look at eagle. Okay, this is going to be downhill a lot. A lot. And I think swinging from right to left quite a bit as well. Good effort. Didn't quite swing that much. Going to be about 8 foot. Alright, 7 foot 4 inches for a birdie. Not a bad putt, it was very difficult. Very difficult to manage that putt. Foot putt. We, need to, we need to watch a deckies one. For sure. It, he's aiming a little bit right of it. And yeah, okay. Not much in it. It didn't look like there was that much in it. So we should be able to make the birdie still. And he'll remain right where he is. 
Yes, good birdie. Uh, yes. Good birdie. All right. right we needed it, too. We needed it big time. Two holes left. Can He's we play them under par? Maybe birdie, birdie, get under par for the tournament. We're inside the cut line as it stands now. Just about, though. Just about. 66. A lot of people at level par, huh? Cut line move to even. Cut line move to even, boys. Can go for it? Is there any benefit to me going for that, really? Yeah, might as well. It's really Get aggressive. We need to be trying to get the eagles and stuff off. yeah beautiful drive i mean that's as good as it gets right there get over this get over this and it's beautiful no it's so soft yeah, it really hit the there. ground good that balance. soft man good come on good start. all right ain't no problem the deck is gonna lay up to the left hand side here might as well we need to get up and down for the birdie if we want to make this cut we need to get to level par that before the sim takes hard. over we cannot out. rely on that. You gotta make that cut, baby. Deki Matsuyama. I clipped the tree, but that's actually gonna help him, I think. No, it's gonna spin a little too much. Good shot, though. Uh, 15 foot up the hill. Exactly 15 foot. I'm good at that, huh? huh? Oh, Lord, I'm good. Good chance to get one in close from here. This is second. Yeah, second. All right, let's put this close. Come on, let's go. Kick in birdie. Let's go. I think we deserve to make the cut for how we play it. We've had some really great, some great holes. We had the eagle. Had a couple great birdies. Hideki Matsuyama has a great birdie there. But it'll all be down to what we do on this ninth hole, I feel. All right, we've made the cut line now. We're on the cut line. Hideki Matsuyama makes birdie to get under power and inside the cut line. We're hovering on it. I think uh, It definitely doesn't go to one under. The cut line definitively does not go to one under. It's probably going to stay at level par, I would say. I right, want to be to the right of this. Lefty's bunkers, rather. Uh, it's pushed out there. Drawing in enough? I think it should be fine. Oh, wow. What a horrible bounce that is. Hmm. Birdie here would be hu huge. It would be huge. All right, Hideki. Good shot, brother. Perfect straight. Good three wood. Good three wood from Medeki, but he's left himself 209 yards. So Let's see if he can put it close. Let's see if he made the right decision. The four. Looks like he's a little bit left. Oh no. Oh no, Hideki. That's in the bunker, son. That's right, wind behind us. Lies good. 148 to the front. Do I hit? I think I'm hitting this. 154. Wind's with me. An S9 iron. Open this is enough. I think it is, you know. More than enough. Sit, 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 sit. A good shot. It's a good shot. It's just over the pin. About 20 foot for birdie. 25 foot. Okay. If we could make that, that would be huge, and that would probably confirm our uh, third shot. Our status for the weekend. But we can't rely on it. That's for sure. We're gonna need some help from the sim no matter what here, I think. So they're just making this would give us yeah, such a big, such a big boost. Pretty downhill, I would say about five inches, yeah. It's level, I feel like down, the further down you go, it breaks to the left a little bit, I could be wrong. Yep, uh, you heard her. Listening to me. I'm right about that. Come on, get in. Good effort, but that's gonna wander a few feet. Oh, by. if that cost me, if I miss the cut by a shot, that's gonna be heartbreaking. That's gonna be bloody heartbreaking, man. Oh, ah, Quail Hollow's brutal, boys. Oh my god, back to back cut watches, boys. That's tough. It's tough to take. Just hope we make it. Would love to play the weekend here at Quail okay, Hollow. Wait, I finished level? Oh no, no. It hasn't seemed my, the rest of my score yet. This is going to be intense. Cut lines at level par. I have to go level or under par for the remainder of the round with the sim. Okay, a shake of the head. Hideki and makes the cut. Hideki off. makes the cut. Do we no make the cut though? One over par. Uh... No! Golfer Frank, it is on. Oh, the cut line moved to two over, though. Yes, yes, the number.
Oh, we made it. Okay, exactly thank God. Just about, my friends, just about. Wow, I've done all of this in 30 minutes flat? Uh, you know what I'm gonna do in this video? I'm gonna power through, I'm gonna do the whole Wells Fargo Championship. We're gonna do the whole thing in this video. What? Just because, you know, these quick rounds are going by pretty quickly, actually. So why not? Shane Lowry is leading the thing. Instead of doing some challenges, we're just gonna do the whole tournament. And then the next video, we can start up the major championship. I think that's a fun way to do it. Because right now, I don't I don't think this would even be enough for a full video. So let's uh, let's go onwards to round three. Third round of Quail Hollow, let's get it. Where are we starting the third round? Three? All right, we're playing pretty much the same stretch of holes then. Are we gonna play six holes here? Four holes again, okay. All right. Yeah, they're not giving us too much to play this, uh, this round, it feels like. One over again. All right. Get a hole in one. A dead left. All right. Uh, the perfect start. It's gonna be on the green at least. At least it's not in the bunker, okay, son. We'll take it. We'll take it, matey. Hideki one under, we're two over. Oh, he nearly kills the bird. Hideki almost killed the bird. Good shot, Hideki. Fair play to you, buddy. It's below a little bit. It's not that far downhill. I would say maybe four or five inches. Huge swing from left to right, he said. So I'm going to go out to here. Good effort. Not enough, though. Good effort. Stop. Stop. Jesus, stop. Good Lord Almighty. Whale Hollow has broken us. And this is a little bit of a slippery one. All right, Hideki, what you got for us, pal? Exercise some caution. Slightly downhill with right to left. Bang! Hideki Matsuyama makes it. Gets the two under. Go on, Hideki. All right, we're going to have a good moving day along with Hideki, all right? Me and Hideki, we're good friends. I want to have a good moving day. Are you sure about What? I guess we will not have a good moving day. There's a both now. Okay, so... This doesn't make much sense, does it? Ah, uh, good stuff. Oh. If it was below when there was back there, back. and I was above when I was there, I mean, how does that mean? How does that even add up, man? How does that add up? We're three over, dude. Fail Hollow is breaking me in front of my family, in front of my friends. Hideki Matsuyama's showing me up. Left side, as you can see, that is about 330 yards. That person is inside of that other person. Two bunkers on the right. To the left there. They are inside of each other, and not in a sexual way. To the position so exactly it's where you even weirder. I need to go get some water. I'm heated. And that will do just fine. All right, guys. Let's see if we can uh, if we can get something going here on moving day, just for these few holes, even. Because obviously this hasn't gone our way today. My swing has been all over the place, and there's another miss hit. Is that going to stay in the fairway? No issues here. going to be standing in the bunker, though. Fairway. Unless it's going to move my ball. I don't know. I feel like it might. It does that sometimes when they feel like your, your guy can't fairway. stand properly or something. He's got All right, Hideki. Put one close, brother. To the hole. I'm Would rooting for you now that I'm out of this tournament, pretty much. Good shot, Hideki. Well done. Be careful that you don't we are standing in the bunker. Let's see if we can... Uh, if we can get it on this left. Pulled. Hold it. All right, it's just been a bang average week here at Quail Oh, We're going to need like much to better closer, golf than this feet, if we want to make the cut with the at the major point. and play well at the major, do well at the major. That's the, the goal, right? I feel like this breaks quite a bit towards the end of the putt. And I was right about that. Breaks even more than that. Jesus, good effort, though. Great effort. Stop, stop. Great effort. All right. It's been a little too aggressive with these putts as well, though. I need to stop giving them so much pace. But I have been making the ones back, so it's not like it's the end of the world, really. Let's see if Hideki can make a birdie. Hideki Matsuyama! Yes, sir! Back-to-back oh, yes. -back birdies for Hideki. He gets the three under. Well done, Hideki. Bang. Good putt. Hold on. All right, par. We've got two holes left. Let's, uh, let's birdie them both, huh? Birdie the par three. Maybe even eagle the par five. Let's see. Play these two holes in two under anyway. That's the goal. Oh, it's this hole? Christ, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> We're back to this poor part of the course. Nightmare. Hate this hole. I tell you what, with that pin position, it's near on impossible. That's how you play it. You gotta land it on the fringe there. I feel like if he had landed that anywhere but the fringe, he was screwed there, you know? 
I'm going out though. I might as well be aggressive and go for a bloody hole in one or something. There's no point in me being me being a little bitch here. In the short grass. What is this to the front of the green? Over on that side? I feel like it might be more than 234 though. Alright. Go at it with this club. Bit of a high high swing on a high fade. Actually play a high draw because I'm scared it's gonna clip the trees otherwise. Let's be the one. Be the one for me. Long. Way long. Holy moly. Is that long or what? Holy smoke show, that's long. All right. It's going to be a horrible yeah, putt from up here. It's going to be truly long, awful from up here, man. This is going to be at least a, a foot down, right? Here at Quail oh, Hollow. my this God. It's going to be horrible. One for birdie. I feel like it breaks back to the left halfway through this putt. Let's go 45. Uh, it's going to break left or break right immediately, but I feel like it breaks back to the left at the end. Uh, maybe not that. I don't know. It's hard to read. I come back. I come back. Still way too much. That's crazy. It's okay. That's okay. We'll take that. Seven foot for par here. As long as we make the par, I'll take it. I'd love to get a car by getting a hole in one or something, but... Not to be. Salabi. Good shot from Hideki. We're going to be putting first for our par. I think it breaks a little bit from left to right once it gets up there. I was correct. Yeah, good putt. Well That's in for good par. putt. Par five coming. Right, let's finish strong. All right, let's finish strong. Hideki's six shots ahead of us now, for God's sake. We need to need to get our shit together here, all right? Get your shit together, young man. Hideki's missed, though. You suck, Hideki. Okay, it's a bogey here at number six. There you go, six. par five, okay. I'm hoping the pin's easier this time. Not near the water. Let's just hit a good tee shot. Let's just focus on hitting a good tee shot, all right? That is not a good tee shot, sir. Please get lucky. This one working up the right side. Please get lucky. It's lucky. Jesus Christ, man. What am I up to? Here, sure, the sim hasn't helped us, but I've been struggling too. I've had a couple of good holes here and there. But overall, we really haven't played well. Ducky hits a good drive, though. Yeah, that's a nice swing in the result. I still yeah, feel like we can get off this, though. Shot that if, is as long as the, the pin is not the front of the green. If we can run it on a little bit, I think we're fine. I think I see the pin there at the back left. I could be wrong, but I think I'm seeing the pin at the back left there. Deki Matsuyama. That second shot got all the way down. You know, what I forgot as well is that we weren't going to do sim on the quick events. <laughs> you remember that for the future, huh? Right, good luck. Are they really going to make me hit it at this? Oh, for God's sake. Making me hit it like this. Doesn't matter if it's good though. Oh my god, go in for an albatross. What a shot! Come on! Let's go! That's gonna be an eagle. Finally, something happens yeah, for us, man. We're gonna finish with a bang. What a shot. Maybe I should play from that view all the time. <laughs> Exactly Get nine right. birdies at Whistling Two Straits. I need to do the tournaments thing because all the tournaments are at, at Whistling Straits. More than well rewarded. Poor bunker shot from Hideki, and he's still going to be away for his birdie, eh? <laughs> from the middle of the fairway for you, too, Hideki. All right, not exactly you suck, kid. Nice watch for, on Hideki, though. I like that, actually. I never noticed birdie that before. Still in play. Birdie putt coming Hideki's up. Hideki's got a little watch on him. And not a particularly hmm. demanding putt here. Maybe slightly down an incline, but it is dead straight. Yeah, he didn't play it that straight, though. It's going to be a par for Hideki. It's going to be an eagle for us, though. That should get us back to one over, at least. better than that. Well, I'm not gonna give me. I'm not gonna this. give me eagle this yet. Eagle. Uphill. Come on, big eagle oh, yeah. there. Come on. What a shot. A Lovely hurling. Hideki's gonna finish with a par. Off. A par He's gonna finish the round four under. Fair play. I think we stayed at one so over. Yep. Goal, okay. Good Level and par round. That's fine. Thirteen shots seen. back of the lead it's heading into well the final round. Now we have one birdie really and one bogey. Wells Fargo fourth round. Let's get it. I'm playing with Jason Day. I haven't played with Jason Day yet. You know. Have we? I don't feel like we played with Jason Day at all yet. And he looks slick in the all black too. Jason Day, you're looking good. You know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn zoom on for this round as well. I'm not gonna put the green grids on, but we're gonna we're gonna put zoom on. I like playing with the green grids off now. I've actually kind of got used to it. Season long race. But I played the last six holes with Jason Day. I'm gonna put zoom on. Ah, look at that push. All right, it's gonna be 
just over the back there. I think it stays in the light rough, does it? I haven't seen Jason play much at all. Cool to be playing with someone different, though. Jason Day, middle of the green, solid shot, smart shot. And you wouldn't say no to that, would you, Jason? You wouldn't so no no dear but ya. Okay, that one's dancing. What? I hit a spinner because I'm in the rough. 4.1 degrees above. It's quite a bit above. Stop! 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 God, I just can't get it going on this course, man. It's to be a unfortunate, really right? Tough side hill putt. He's got a, a tough one for you. To right and then let it Jason. To the hole. Jason. Oh, Remember that from Heavy Rain. Jason. <laughs> oh, Heavy Rain, what a game! I actually love that game, but that meme is so funny. Jason. 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 Hey, Apex is under read another putt. I'm doing it in 2K. I'm doing it in EA. The Apex is under reading all these putts. That's how he rolls, huh? Just about made that one, to be honest. Bogey. Silly bogey. Got five holes left. I am putting it here right now. I am going to finish level par for this. Why does it look like I have a bald spot there? It's because the way my hair... The fuck? Like, that looks like I have a bald spot there. Because my hair is pushed back like this. I have a, a full head of hair I'll have, you know, guys. Let's see. It's full as fuck. Look at that. Oh, it's glorious. It's glorious. Okay. Okay. I'm going gray, yes. But I'm not losing my hair yet. <laughs> it's full. All right, we're, we're driving this. I actually feel like I'm going to hit an even better shot than last time. I'm feeling it. Where do we go from here? I'm feeling this. Turn the lights down now. I'm feeling this. The only problem with this is you need to land it like a foot short on that on this soft grass. I don't want the power drive. I want this. I want to bring this back to like here. Watch and learn how it's done, my friends. That could actually work, you know. Just need to bounce to the right. No, it's short as well. <gasps> nice bounce. Nice bounce. I thought that was going to bounce stone dead. Great shot. Be a chip from there. Maybe a little uh, eagle. How about it? Back to back team, eagles uh, when we played this hole? Got what you got, Jason? Now a short one, Jason Day! Seconds. Your all black outfit is bugging me. It looks so good. It looks so good, Jason. I love Jason Day, actually. Great guy. Seems just like a top guy. Jason, I'm making this eagle for you, baby. Oh, great effort. A truly spectacular effort there. Well, I wouldn't go that far, but it was a great effort. <laughs> it's going to be a birdie. I told you guys, I'm finishing level par. Jason Day gets to level par. Back to back birdies for him. And he has a par five to come. Go on, Jason, son. All right, beautiful. Easy does it there. It's a birdie Bounce back, 14. birdie. Bounce back, birdie after the bogey. We got four holes left, and I'm going two under for them at least. Two under for these four. Start with a birdie here on the part five. How do you feel about the full the full tournament in, in one video, guys, with the quick rounds? Because honestly, it wasn't that bad, was it? We've been, I've, we have four holes left. I've only been playing for 52 minutes. Not been that bad, honestly. Jason Day. Wave to the crowd. I mean, I wouldn't do this every time, but I'm just saying, like, when you're in a mode like this where it's working really quickly, might as well. Bang. Look at that. Gorgeous. Slick. Mm-hmm. Fairway's big enough. Mm-hmm. Good shot. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Look at that lady in the, in the red. She's clapping fast. Try to keep up with the clapping there. All right, we definitely can go at this in two. Jason Day. Boom! What a shot. A little unfortunate with the bounce there. Eh, it's going to be tough from up there. That, that ain't going to be easy from up there, Jason. If I go at this, I think I do. I think I go at this. Play a little bit of a high fade. 
Bring it in with the wind here. Pushed it. I don't know where that push comes from. That's going to be up there with Jason's, honestly. Ah. It's a tough shot. It's a tough you shot, but I don't know how I pushed it that much. Good looking shot. Go in. Go in, Jason. Go in, Jason. Oh! That's going to go off the green, is it? Stop! Oh, that's cruel. Unlucky, Jason. Great Frank, shot. Obvious. He I think a flop a is the only right play here. If those grooves fill up with a little bit of grass, then you have no grooves, then you have nothing really to put the extra spin on the golf ball. Great flop. So that Great flop. flop. Beautifully done. Jason, I would Texas wedge this if I was you, to be honest. Yes. Good idea. Up from the fringe. Bang it on in there, baby. Not quite. I'm rooting for Jason here. I'm rooting for him. Not ideal, Jason. Just now, seven feet for his birdie. <laughs> Come on, back to back birdies, baby. One over. I told you guys. I told you. You didn't want to listen. I'm coming for that level par. Maybe even under par at this rate. I'm feeling this. Where do we go from here? Okay, a solid par here at the 15th. <laughs> Nearly Can didn't go there. in there. Right. As tough a finishing stretch as you will find anywhere in golf. This hole is tough, to be fair. Tee. It does play downhill nearly 10 yards. Just off the so left of the bunker, I think. Bunker on one. the right side is 320. Take away the 10, so it's about 310 to carry. If you Perfect. can take that line, you Perfect. will choose so much off this hole. Perfect. And then the second shot also is a little down breeze and it has like an infinity. Gorgeous edge. shot. You can't see the back of the screen. All right, 213. Let's go. What you got for it, Jason? What you got for us? Not bad. Not bad at all, good sir. He just keeps motoring right along. Extra half club or more as he sets for a second into the wind. Mmm, left. That's a bit of a stinker, Jason. That's a bit of a stinker. The green mile, 55 foot for birdie. I'll show you how good we are. Fade, 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 fade. Man, now that I got that one heartbeat moment, I want, I want more. That's it. I'm chasing that feeling right now. I'm chasing that feeling. God, that felt good. I want another one. God damn. This one's tracking on a very good line. Look out. Jason, 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 Jason. Day from 55 oh, foot. My goodness, wow, that would have been incredible. This one's going to do everything. I can go in the hole. No, it's not. Dang it, man. That one way past too. Really? Even with 8% done this quite way. Quite run to the next hole. I agree. He's made it, though. Oh! Nah, that's going to wander off to the it's right. It's the lid, man. Keep coming back. Bogey, disappointing bogey, my friends. This is not the green model can do to you, but I really hit a good okay. second that shot. It's such a disappointing chip. Oh, and 17 is no joke either. I think that level part, <laughs> that level part has gone out the window now. This is going to be our worst finish. We went from our worst finish on the PGA Tour to our worst finish on the PGA Tour. <laughs> okay, that'll be a par here at oh, 16. Oh, fuck's sake. I'm 49th, actually. People are going backwards. People are going back. I'm telling you, Quail Hollow is just difficult, man. It really is. It's just a difficult course. Jason Day. Uh, it's it's tough, Rich. It, it really what a beautiful hole, you have by to make a decision. It, it plays about half a club downhill. That's five yards. And then the tendency is to try and aim it too straight or, in layman's turn, try and hit too good a shot. Please, just just aim a little to the right. Put another yard or two. Yeah, good shot. shot to the you right went a little bit to the right. I'm getting aggressive, that. though. And then I'm getting real aggressive. Making two. You will gain on the field. I promise you. No, you haven't promised me. I'm going right at this with a six iron. Downhill. Gotta go for a hole in one. A little bit right. Okay. Honestly, I did exactly what he said, pretty much. In the end. Okay, we welcome him. Me and Jason gonna make these putts. This. We're gonna make putt these putts. Yeah, this one's a little what bit got, Jason? overall with a break from left to right to consider also. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful view right there over the water. Jason Day gives it a go. But not quite. Downhill a lot, I would say. Oh, good effort. Good effort. Dang it, man. That's a good effort, but not... All right. Par. 
Good Two over. Need a, we need a whole lot of eagle for level power on the last hole. How about it? You just never know, my son. Hold on, Jason. Oh, Don, my son. On the right. The real trouble, though, and we've seen this with tournaments three drive, years Jason. that have come down to the wire, is that stream on the left. Mm -hmm. If you hook it a little bit too far, you're wet. Then there's that uphill second shot, and the stream is still in I'm play. not going to go left. There's a lot going on here on this finishing hole. Beauty. Actually pushed out a little bit to the right, but perfect shot. Nicely done. Middle of the fairway. And that is dead center. That's as good as it gets right there. Let's finish with a birdie. Come on, boys. Let's finish with a birdie. I would love, love, love to finish with a birdie here at Quail Hollow. Would love it. I would love it if we be um Love it. Frank, what's the key? Jason. Nice shot that just holds from that left side. That's in the stream, Jason. This is what they warned you about, Jason. This is what they warned you about, Jason. No, man. Come on. I'll show you how it's done, okay, Jason? This is how you hold out for ego. Finish level par. I pushed it. All right. That's okay. It's been just a piss poor week, honestly. A piss poor week. I sucked at Quail Hollow. <laughs> All right? I straight up sucked at Quail Hollow. It is what it is. And I'm underswing this on purpose and hold it. I don't give a damn. See? Told you. Eh, not bad. Tap in par at the last. Two over for the week. That's my first time finishing over par, I think, for any championship. Did I finish under? I, yeah, I finished decently under par at the French championship in the end, I think. But Quail Hollow's just been an absolute beast, man. It really has. Like, level par would get you inside the top 35 as it stands right now for Jason Day. He's going to be putting for par here, is he? Great finish. Great par, Jason. Well done. He got to drop it on the green. He loves it. All right, we're going to tap in for par as well. But we're two over, unfortunately. All right. So it's happened there. That's for two over for the land. week. Shane Lowry, is he going to win it? Let's see who wins. No. Say Shane Lowry. Sh Sung Jim, I think Sh Shane Lowry won. Yeah, go on the Irish. We're outside the top 40. Honestly, we went up in positions, even though he, we stayed relatively the same score. We went up about 20 positions. <laughs> so that'll tell you how tough Grail Hollow was playing there, especially in round four. Sorry there, I cut the commentators off completely. But Shane Lowry gets the W at the Wells Fargo Championship. We will be skipping this event here. And in the next event, we will be playing... The major championship. Of course, we're playing the PGA Championship at Southern Hills Country Club in Tulsa, Oklahoma. We move on to another major championship. As you can see, our two worst finishes back to back here at the Wells Fargo Championship, T41 and T53. So this Wells Fargo, even though we were two over, is actually better than our four under finish at the French Championship. That'll tell you. Quail Hollow, as I said, just a beast. We came off a win and a top five at the Masters, and we haven't found our form, but hopefully we can find it again in the PGA Championship. Thanks for tuning in for that, guys. We'll be back for the Major Championship. Who are we going to be playing alongside is the question. We are going to be playing alongside Patrick Cantley. It says, uh, Scotty she or chose Scotty Scheffler there, but we're going to be playing alongside Patrick Cantley, and uh, we're going to be playing the PGA Championship in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate it. It's going to be tough, but it's going to be fun. Can't wait to, to get started on the next Major. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. See you next time. Peace out. Break.